Hey guys, voice lesson um, for Wednesday. This is number three, I believe. And um, before I get into the voice lesson, I want to talk about Friday a little bit because it's going to be kind of complicated. Um, I have a couple things that I'm doing, including a slightly new job, finishing up the VA mural, and um, then I also have class, of course. So um, class is going to be a big test, and then I have to go straight to the VA mural, and then right after that, I have to go to this new job. So um, recording is going to be very difficult. Um, I'll probably be recording and have the video up by like 7 o'clock in the evening. Don't count me on it. I don't want to set any benchmarks and then miss them or anything like that. So um, just watch that. Now, as far as the voice lesson goes, the um, definition for today is going to be vocal cords. Um, now, I have here the definition um, taken from a medical website. I'll post it in the descriptions. I don't want to be like sued for copyright or anything. Um, so what it says is one of two small bands of muscle within the larynx. These muscles vibrate to produce the voice. Vocal cords form a V inside the larynx, a two inch long tube shaped organ in the neck. Um, so what that's basically saying is um, these two cords right here that form a V and move into the chest. Um, now, it's pretty simple to see that. If you want to um, actually see that, just feel around as you do with a whole bunch of different tones and you can feel that um, vocal cord tighten and you can feel it loosen, everything like that. Now, um, as far as how you can use it, um, it's not too hard. Um, yeah, great day to wear a turtleneck, huh? Um, but for men, the vocal cords are actually a lot longer and they all vibrate. And basically, the tightening of the vocal cord down here can create a heightened um, sound. That's how you can use it. Um, so for this week, I want you to practice um, just tightening one portion of the vocal cord, the next portion, and the next portion. Um, it's easier to do this intuitively, but you can just like um, compress one, release the other, and everything like that. Um, it's going to take a while to get the feel of and everything, but that's basically what the vocal cords are doing. If you stop the vocal cords from vibrating in one certain spot, the octave and the resonance, the octave goes up, the resonance goes down, and um, that's exactly what we want. Um, it'll make you sound more feminine because um, female cords are actually a lot shorter and they use this portion right here. They don't use this portion here. Um, so there you go. Um, fun fact, when you're breathing, they're not um, vibrating or anything like that. So if you breathe a little bit, um, you can feel the vibration kind of get a little bit longer and a lot more reduced. Um, just a couple fun facts. Play around with it. Um, it's kind of an intuitive thing to learn, but um, I encourage you to learn um, as quickly as possible. Um, so by next week, um, I'm hoping you'll understand what I'm talking about. Um, if you're not, ask questions. I'll answer them. Um, don't hesitate. Don't be shy. Ask them so we can both learn. Um, otherwise, that's pretty much it. Um, so let's run through a quick voice lesson type of thing where you're going to move back down to your male voice and um, it's just basically going to be the exact same mm, excuse me it's just basically going to be the exact same thing it's going to be male voice to falsetto back to male voice and then up onto your female area um, of voice so we're going to move into falsetto and um, I'm not really too good at this but if you want to pull it down a bit like um add a little and um you should end up like this and it's kind of a manly voice but then you can pull it back and you get something along the lines of this and um now we're going to move back down in the male voice and um basically you want to do this twice um then you're going to move from male to female so it's going to sound like this and um I've kind of settled into the normal voice around here, and I'm planning to improve it. But um, for the most part, you're going to have a, a little bit of tension in the throat. So do this for maybe like two minutes. If you feel like your 
throat is getting stressed, drink the glass of water. Remember to record yourself, that's very important. And um, don't stress your throat too much because you can't do this with a harmed throat. Um, otherwise, that's pretty much it. Um, I look forward to hearing any responses or comments or if you want me to define any portion of it, if you've heard anything on voice lessons, or if you can help me improve by giving me something, then by all means, post it. Um, that seems like a tagline now, isn't it? Post it. Um, <laughs> anyway, uh, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys, and this is the voice lesson for Wednesday. And that concludes it. Bye.